What's up, everybody? I'm Derek Gamer. Welcome back to the channel today. Today, we are back and we are playing Axel Primal. This game is the game you all should be playing because it's amazing. So this game came out about a week ago. About a week ago. And a lot of people play the way it works. Just, I know, it's hard to explain what this game is. So essentially in this game, think of this 5v5. One, made by Capcom. 5v5. You fight monsters, hordes of monsters. Think like Dynasty Warrior stuff, horse coming out, stronger enemies. But at the end, there's a chance to do PvP against other players. There's a support, there's DPS, there's a tank characters you can play. A lot of different characters you can pick from, as you can see all over here. I'll just kind of go through them really quickly. And think of Overwatch, but not, but similar to Overwatch. It's, it's, it's a truly amazing game. The hard thing is a lot of people are like, what is this game about? Just, just builds and stuff too. You know, you guys already know, DG's holding it down, my boy with the white tiger outfit. There's builds, there's customization, there's emos, there's all kind of crazy things you could do in the game. So, essentially, what this oh. game is, is a game that you need to be playing. It's a lot of people, the way it works is, the more you play, like after we do a mission, story starts to unlock. And the more you play, more modes start to unlock as well. So it's not just locked in, you do the same thing over and over. There's about five different modes with new modes coming. Capcom made the game, so you know they're already gonna be giving us a lot of free content, which they already made the roadmap out. The three seasons already confirmed, we're in season one right now. So a lot of action is gonna be coming up. But let me go ahead and load up a map so you can kinda see. There's PvE, Focus, there's, PV, there's PvE and PvP. You go in here, you load up a map, and then you go into the gameplay. And the gameplay is so fun and fluid. You can swap out any class you want any single time that you want. So you're not locked into that one. So if your team needs a healer, you can swap to that. Your team needs more DPS, you can swap to that. Your team needs a tank, you can swap to that as well. And also too, one thing about this game that I truly love is the gameplay is so buttery smooth. It's extremely smooth. So meet me with Leviathan. This is the main character of the game. What he does is he is AI. He wants to get data. So the more he fight, the more he learns, the better he gets. That's the opposing party on the other side. This is the kind of warning, warm up screen. You can kind of see what you're going against. You can switch out your party at any time if you want to. There's four moves that you have on your character to use at any time to fight. And I can just switch out if I want to go to tank or this one all i do is hit triangle like that and i switch out to the other class that i want to boom so you can build proficiency with so many different characters at a time you don't need to stay locked into one so now now we're into the game let me give you a little preview of what the game is like the tanks over there our job is to take out the dinosaurs take them out boom 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 Cool thing about me, I am a counter melee player. It's not just melee, there's guns, there's magic, all kind of crazy things to do. Now I do even more damage than I got my extra dope lightsaber going crazy on them. So if you see at the top, it shows a blue circle and a red circle. These are the enemies I'm going against. It kind of tells you like how fast you're going versus your peer, your enemies, your competitors. And the forward gets to the match faster wins. But also, there's two rounds in each match. And the second round, it gives you an opportunity to kind of catch up by literally attacking the other enemies. But I get it. A lot of the things I would say, the shortcomings that a lot of people like, turn off too easily, is you need to get through at least 20 matches before like things start really opening up. You start getting your builds situated. You start finding a, a different, more variety of enemies. And once you get past that point, it's off to the race lines at that point. Typically, in Monster Hunter games or Capcom games, the max level is like 999 based on how much you want to grind. I don't think anybody be hitting the main level, the max level anytime soon. Also, as well, they're going to be giving beta no, new variants to the monsters. I mean, to our armor suits. What does that mean? Is you're going to have new abilities available to you that you can learn and master okay. that are extremely crazy. So my boy right now, he uses his katana and when you hit the counter, it lights up. Oh, see, I missed it. The problem with mine is I have a limited amount of time to get my counter off. They have to hit me in the middle of it. If they don't, I have to start over. 
Oh, got him going. Beautiful. But I'll switch to the DPS so you guys can see what that looks like as well. I'll give you guys a little bit of variety of play style. This dude is pretty amazing too. If you like fast combat, just like I said, you want to switch out of the matches when you're in a safe position like I am right now. This dude can double jump. He can, tell, he can do kicks in the air. He can teleport. But as you know, the only thing when you're playing this DPS character, you're squishy. You don't have as much health as everybody else. So our goal here is to defend this area. This actually would have been better for my counter player because I was waiting for them to come to me and hit him with the nice juicy counters. But for now, I'm just going to take you guys into battle. So you can see. I, I would have been playing some classes I haven't played yet. Just to show you how much fun you're going to experience in this game. I know the reviews came out and they were like, oh, the game is okay. But the problem is the reviewers didn't give it in. Didn't play long enough to really truly get into it. Well, bring it out, bring it out. What's coming? What's coming? More, please. Let's stay close to so the heals faster. Because you want to make sure you stay focused on the objective too. Not just having the fun taking everything out. Let's do. Let's do this one. I've never played this class. This is the healer class, the support class. Let's get in there. But I feel confident enough being able to figure it out. Oh, all right. Make sure everyone's good. But whatever you're into, you can play any class you look at you like. I typically like to play DPS classes. Okay, okay. Let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Let's hit the super DPS. It looks like there's a look to my other suits. But I'm really just giving you guys an overview of the different classes. Let's see how it goes down. Okay, so we're back into a final mission now. <laughs> so if you want to run and gun, you can too. Why would you give him a dominator? Oh. 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 Oh, they got me. I gotta watch out. Because I'm DPS class, I'm a little squishy. Let's go back to my main boy and bring this yes, home. Sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Oh my God, I almost got. I appreciate the welcome party. Keep going. Ah. Oh. My team came and helped me. Oh, we need to get this guy too. It tells you what the objectives are, what you're supposed to be going after. You guys want to get to him? I can focus on this dude. Nice. Got a juicy counter. And if you notice, the screen's going crazy. But there's not one single drop in frames at all. But all these enemies on screen. Mmm. Healer. I need my healer. You can communicate too. I appreciate that. Let's go. Next. Next. It's like I was saying, these matches are action packed. Wow. Oh, Contour is coming. It's like a mini T Rex. Oh, oh. Finish them quickly. Oh. Ah. Give me a move. Hit me. Ah. Where is that? I can't even see it. You know, I was about to hit it right there. Is there two of them? No. That rapper's got me. All right, this one's almost done. All right, get the flying dudes. Sometimes people try to focus on just attacking anything and not the objective. Last one. All right, come on. Are we at any lead still? Watch, hurry up. I think they are. I think they're behind us. Ooh. So it gives us a dominator. What dominator is? You become a dinosaur. So now I can go do PvP on my enemies. Then we'll do PvP towards the end. I'm glad I get to give you guys the full experience. 
all the things you get to experience. All right, let's go. I'll oh, see this dude over here. Easy, <laughs> easy. Ah, uh, you want to take out the healer first? Always take out the healer first. <laughs> oh my God! Jeez, this dude that the shield is so good. Oh, the mayhem. Yeah, I'm keeping shields up, bro. No, they finally got me. But yo, we, 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 did, we did a lot of work in there. We did a ton of work. Wait, get the birds. Oh. They didn't want me after all. Yes. Good, good. Good. And this one was pure PvP. PvE. But in other matches on the second round we just did, you fight against your other peers if you like. But the game is action packed. I highly recommend everyone checking it out. It's still early. The game just came out. They already announced a bunch of free content. I said that free content coming out to the game. We'll be streaming the game live on Twitch if you want to see more action and see all the things that we unlock later on. My family, if you're new, make sure you guys subscribe. Join the Smooth family. Give the video a thumbs up. That just supports me for free. Until next time, dear gamers, signing out.